Hey everybody, it's I'm Avalanche Fan here with more Pokemon XD Gale Darkness. So in the last episode we started our battle against Greevil. We caught his Lugia, obviously. And uh, we also snaked two of his Shadow Pokemon so far today. We've caught his uh, Shadow Rhydon and his Moltres, which is incredible. So, um, we're just going to use Shadow Blast on Exeggutor and weaken it a little bit, but not too much. And then bite on Tauros. Um, I'm surprised Jolteon's still hanging in there. That's that's awesome. All right, that's close. Not too confident using Bite again. Now here's Shadow Blast, most epic Shadow move ever, and the most powerful nonetheless. Tauros is flinched, and Shadow, and who's it hitting? Come on, give me Shadow Lugia. Ooh, so sorry, Jolteon. You will not be forgotten, though, my friend. You did so much for me. Alright, so we're gonna send in uh, Glalie here. Now, I gotta be cautious with Glalie because it's very dangerous. So, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna use Shadow Blast on Tauros. And I think I'll take a risk and try using uh, Ultra Ball and Exeggutor. I think I can get away with it now because he is weak and paralyzed, so that should be good. I'm actually doing better than I thought I would. Uh, to catch two is Pokemon only, and not even at, not, not a, not even using ten of my Ultra Balls, that's pretty good. Um, now we've caught Exeggutor, that's three. So we're, we're doing very good here, this is very good. So the next Pokemon he sends out is Articuno, he's got two of the legendary birds. And look at this, he's got four Shadow Pokemon. He's just twisted, I tell you, twisted. All right, so we're using Shadow Blast on Tauros here. Now let's see, Tauros says Shadow Sky, ooh. Now, I'm very surprised here. I'm doing better than I thought I would. All right, so the flashing lights hit Glalie, and that's it. <laughs> okay, so, um, what are we gonna do here? I'm gonna try some here, I'm just gonna see if it works. I don't know if it's gonna. Um, I'm gonna try an Ultra Ball on Tauros here, and uh, I think we'll just use Crunch on Articuno. I'm not too confident yet with Articuno. So let's see if an Ultra Ball can do it on Tauros. If it does, this will be very good. This will be four Shadow Pokemon I've caught in two episodes. So one, two, three, caught it! That's four! Four out of, well, four out of four. Or three out of four, I should say. So he sends out Zapdos. He's got all three legendary birds. And guess what? He's a Shadow Pokemon as well. All six of his Pokemon are Shadow Pokemon. Yeah, hard to believe, isn't it? And and I'm just going to make a quick note here. Oh, you got to be kidding me. No, you did not just free Shadow Lugia. You did not just do that, Articuno. Not cool. But anyways, as I as I was saying, I just gotta make a quick note. Quick note here, guys. Never have I ever faced Grievel and actually caught four of his Shadow Pokemon. I've never done this, so I'm doing better than I really thought I was. So this is good. This is very good right now. Um, all right. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna unfreeze. Use our Ice Heal. Finally comes in handy for once on Lugia and. Um, I'm going to try using Crunch again on Articuno. Alright, so Zapdos has Shadow Bolt, and that move specifically designed for Zapdos. Um, just like Shadow Chill specifically designed for Articuno. Now, his Pokemon are faster than mine now, which kind of sucks, but I mean, what are you going to do? Ooh, not good. Not good. But we should, hopefully we should still be good here. Okay, so a little more damage than last time because it's a special defense drop, so still good actually. We're still doing good. Now, I want to be very careful here because I don't want to, because I'm, I'm going to be honest here, guys. When I was making these videos, I made a promise to myself that I was going to catch all six of Greedle's Shadow Pokemon, that I was going to end it here. I was not going to go back for a second time, so I'm going to take a chance here. But before I do, I'm going to use a revive here and bring back Jolteon. Shadow Bolt, who's gonna use it on? Yeah, okay, okay, I saw that coming. Alright, so Glalie's down. 
So we're gonna send out, sh yeah, shift tree. Okay, so we're still doing good though. We're up, we're up six to what, six to or four to two, I think. All right, so let's see how much shadow blasts are to two. No, not too much, but that's actually not bad. All right, so shadow chill again. So I wonder who this is gonna be on Glaley or shift? Yeah, shift three. Whoa, that's a pretty good amount of damage there. Um, now I'm gonna guess Shetri's gonna go down here. Um, so you shadow blast on Akuna. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see how much bullets he does to Zagos if I can. But you never know. He could be targeting Lugia. Nope, sad to say not. All right, so we've lost our four original Pokemon. We're down to two. Or actually, it's two or three. Okay, three technically. So we're gonna use our Marowak here. And this is and this is why I took. Uh, Eldest is Marowak. I wanted to have one other Shadow Pokemon with me besides uh, Lugia. So we're gonna see how much it does. Is it putting me yellow? Oh, puts him in the yellow, which isn't bad. All right, Shadow Chill is up next. I'm almost. To, ooh, that's not good. I'm almost tempted to. Uh, uh, the Shadow. Well, Shadow Sky won't affect anyone anymore. Um, I'm almost tempted to use an Ultra Ball on uh, Articuno here. You know what? I've got what? I've got 92 of them left. I can use 40, what, like 46 or something like that per Pokemon. So I think we can risk one. So I'm just going to try it here, see what happens. If it works, it works. And if it doesn't, I'm not too worried at the moment. I'll be worried when I run out of Ultra Balls. That will be worrisome. But in the meantime, not too worried. So we've got one, two, Three? Oh, ugh, so close. Okay, so Shadow Bolt. All right, so hit Marowak for about 37, 27 damage, sorry, I should say. All right. All right, Articune is a bit weaker now. Shadow Chill, I'm hoping they aim for Lugia. I prefer them to hit Lugia than Marowak because, yeah, okay. That's okay, that's okay. So, um, you know what? I'm not gonna attack this turn, because I wanna get some heal. You know, use a super potion on Lugia, that should be enough to last them a little bit. Worst comes to worst, I can revive Shadow Lugia, but I don't think <laughs> Zapdos and Articuno are gonna do that much damage to Lugia. So now that Articuno's a bit weaker, I'm gonna try an Ultra Ball here, again. So like I said guys, I made a promise to catch all six Pokemon here, and the, the fact I caught four is already amazing. Considering Moltres didn't take too much to catch. So one, okay. But hey, that's what happened last time. This is exactly what happened last time. So we can't, uh, we can't consider ourselves out yet. All right, so let's see how much Shadow Chill does. All right, they're both going for Lugia. That, that's the good thing. I, I prefer if they both go for Lugia. Now, this is going to sound really stupid. I'm going to hit Articuno with Shadow Blast first. I'm just going to try something. I don't know if this is going to work. And the odds of this are like 1 in 100, I'd say. We're going to try using an Ultra Ball on Zapdos, just for the heck of it. I don't know if this is going to work. It's probably not. But you never know. Crap happens. I mean, look at everything before. I've caught Pokemon with Great Balls. I didn't think we were going to work. Let's see if it works. One, two, three? Oh, man! I can't believe I actually got three, three, uh, mostly flicks, three flicks. That's very surprising. <laughs> oh, he's paralyzed? Crap. Wait, he's still you Shadow Blast, which is good. That's still very shocking, my god. <laughs> All right, Shadow Chill. Man, this is just... <laughs> Alright guys, I'm just going to call it here just for now. But don't worry, still more to come. Definitely still more to come. I think my food is here and I'm hungry. So I'll be right back guys. Don't worry, still more to come. Stay tuned for more Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness.